when you... You're not hitting under your child. Hit me. Uh, you on camera, a Eugene police officer hits a child after he says the boy bit him. Good evening, I'm Yasmin Jar. And I'm Tom Adams. Thanks for joining us tonight. David Walker has the night off. We first told you about this story last night, and since then, we received cell phone video of the ordeal. KVAL's Kelsey Dudley spoke to the woman who says she shot the video. Kelsey also spoke to the police. She joined us now with more. A custody battle took place in Monroe Street Park Sunday night and had more than just the family involved after emotions ran high. A 10 year old boy is caught in the middle of a very public custody battle Sunday night. Eugene police say the boy's father, Brian Wolf, contacted them, stating he had a court order giving him custody of his son. Police say the mother, Stephanie Johnston, was living in a bus at Monroe Street Park. When officers arrived to take the boy, they say his mom told her son to just run away. The police are going to take you away. An officer caught the boy. That's when Christina Bailey started taking video with her cell phone. You can see the officer hit the boy's head in the video. The officer says he did it because the boy bit him. People in the park were outraged. You do not hit an underage child. Officer Sam Kamkar says the officer's response was calm and professional. He, uh, he continues to display professionalism uh, even after he's bit by this 10-year-old. Eugene police say they were just doing their job. It's about that 10-year-old, and uh, we got to make sure that that 10-year-old is taken care of, and then everybody else comes second to that. We did talk to the woman who shot the video. She says she wishes it hadn't happened in such a public place. The investigation is still ongoing, and the Department of Human Services is looking into all the issues and concerns. <laughs> Camera, a Eugene police officer hits a child after he says the boy bit him.